Hey folks, this is Joe from JoeColantonio.com. In this video, we're going to create a DLL in C Sharp and call it from Quick Test Professional. So the first thing you want to do is start up Visual Studio. If you don't have Visual Studio, you can also use the C Sharp Express from Microsoft. That's free. So let's create a new project. And for the new project, we're going to use the class library. And we're going to call it QTP. Dot automation. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to rename class one to I'm going to call it QTP. And in that class, we're just going to create a very simple method that adds two numbers together. So once we have the code we want to use, we just need to make some changes to the properties. So I'm just going to right click on my project and go to properties. And under application, uh, the first thing I'm going to do is go to the assembly information. And I'm just going to click on make assembly com visible. So make sure you have that selected. And the last thing I'm going to do is go to the build section. And under build, under output, I'm going to go to register for comp and make sure that that's checked. And I'm just going to save my project. And then I'm just going to build my project. So I'm going to go build, build solution. Cool, no errors. All right. So we have a class and we have a method called add. We're good to go now. All we need to do is stop Quick Test Professional and call the class that we just created. All right, so to call the DLL, all we need to do is just use two lines of code. And we're going to use QTP's built in create object. So it's going to be QTP automation. and the name of our class is QTP. Let's just put the return value in a message box. And so the name of our method is add, so it's gonna be add. And it has two parameters, so we're gonna pass it six and four. Let's run QTP and see what happens. Awesome, we get the correct result, which is 12. And that's it, that's how you call a C-Shop DLL from Quick Test Professional.